Um, are you asking me what it means to me to be the football coach at Texas? Yeah, I, um, I mean, it's a, a special place. It's, it's one of the best places to coach football in the country. Uh, I've said many times when Sally sat and asked me, do you want to go to Texas, and if, if so, why? Uh, she said, what would your dad and your granddad say if they were alive and sitting here today? I'd say anybody who has a chance to coach football where Coach Darrell Royal coached it would be crazy not to take that opportunity. And um, that's what's so special about this place. You have a, we're sitting here at 6-3 and three and 101,000 come and, and support your team. And uh, they're all dressed in orange and yell and scream till the end. You've got uh, one of the top recruiting classes coming in again. Um, I just think it's an it's an unbelievable place to coach, and I'm really lucky to have been here 14 years and plan on being here for a long time. I've enjoyed this rivalry. You know, this is uh, this will be my 14th year. Uh, this will be our seventh game in College Station. Uh, some of the TV people said, "What? Can you just imagine that atmosphere?" And I said, "Yeah, I've seen it. The other six games, they can't yell more than as loud as they can yell. I mean, that's been the way it's been over there every time. They they've got tremendous support. It's a great place to play." Um, I, I, I don't think it's good for high school Texas football not to be able to showcase that game across the country. It's, it's been a fun game for me to coach in and, and watch before I got here. Um, someone asked my, my best memory uh, and my worst. The, it's, it's easy. The best one was out here with Ricky winning the Heisman, probably and breaking the national rushing record. And you got John David Crow, who's a great friend of mine. Uh, R.C. Slocum's a great friend of mine and will continue to be so. Gene Stallings is a great friend of mine. They're not good friends. They're great friends that I talk to a lot. Uh, and you've got uh, John David Crow on the sideline, Earl Campbell, T Tony Dorsett. And I even saw that clip yesterday again of him uh, on that run. And, and then the worst one is, is easy. That's the losing those kids in the bonfire uh, will be a memory on Thanksgiving I'll have for the rest of my life. And it's not a good memory. It's a, um, as a father, uh, I, I hope and pray I die before my kids. Uh, I do not want to bury a child. And anybody who has, it's, it's got to be the worst thing that can possibly happen in your life. And uh, it's, a, it's one memory that's negative I have every Thanksgiving now. Is that's those 12 sets of parents that lost those kids. I mean, they, they have to know this is the week for, for the rest of their lives. And, and that has to be a very difficult memory. The rest of them have been games, and there have been some great games. And... Um, and I think that part will be missed. What will be unique will be what will happen now. Uh, I, I don't know. I still haven't been told whether we'll play on Thanksgiving or who we would play. So I, as, I, I don't know if rumors have been out there about it, but I haven't been told. Um, we have been told that it will not be A&M for the um, near future.